Hi, my name is Raimundo Arnone, well known like Dino, because from my name is coming Raimondino. I'm uh, in Norway since 2008, 2008, and I started the business on 2016. Gluten-free product, glue not. Glue not coming from glue, gluten not not. It's also more American or English translation or name. Why glue not? Uh, because I'm Italian, and uh, when we're talking Italy, we're talking about uh, food, wine, olive oil. And on, it was a little bit of lack of gluten-free product or knowledge in Norway. It was just pre-made product, that's it. So let's open a bakery. Let's be my hand, Chef Dino, behind the product. This is why we, this is why I did it, glue not. Something fresh, actually not food creating experience. So when the people are coming here, sit down, they have to experience my pizza. They don't have to eat my pizza. The why I did that because the when you are coming here with the family, your kids has a, is a celiac does it gluten, and all the family can sit and enjoy my pizza without feel the different. So let's make people celiac to feel uh, to feel well known every place, well uh, welcome, welcomes in all the place. So when you are coming here, you have a gluten free heaven. We are gluten-free since 2016. I'm eating gluten-free without gluten, I'm celiac. So when I go in one restaurant and I don't feel sure, it's the worst feeling you can get. Because you sit down, you go out with the friends, you sit down, you cannot eat this, you cannot eat that. You are not sure if you can eat. Sometimes you eat one salad and go home. So this is why Glunot, we are, why we build Glunot to get experience. So food experience. And all the recipe are uh, repeated many times. To make the gluten-free mix, I was working for three years to make the gluten-free mix, to blending the nice, blending the nice, the right uh, product, the right uh, recipe, imported from Italy from a company which does work with other uh, only gluten-free, does work with uh, any gluten, so safe place. And all the process from Italy to Norway is saved process. So this is why we, uh, this is the secret of our pizza. Five ingredients, blending the, blended in the, pro, in the right way, and then the recipe is coming after that. So also uh, the recipe is uh, made it for this kind of mix. Of course, when you're coming in Glunot, when we are, like I say, it's uh, pizza, pasta, and mandolin, they say in, in Italy. So we are also about pasta. This is a pasta from Italy, Gragnano. So the history of the pasta, dry pasta, is in Napoli, my area, in Gragnano. So we have the best quality of pasta. When we are talking about olive oil, we have different kind of olive oil from uh, south of Italy, Apulia, from Sicily, from Toscana. Tomato, when we are talking about tomato, is cherry tomato from Syracuse. When we are talking about uh, the rice flour, flour uh, rice, is coming from north of Italy, which is, they produce only corn and rice. No contamination, no can contain wheat flour or other, uh, other uh, allergen, let's say, allergy. Safe. safe, yes, perfectly safe. Uh, the funny part of my building the pizza, it is also in, uh, there is a disease in the world which you cannot eat so much proteins. So my pizza can contain low proteins, 0.1, which some of uh, the people can eat. In Norway, we have approximately only 500 people with this disease, which they can, only place they can eat pizza is here in Trisil. We have the pizza. But then when we're talking about pasta, there is also on the, on the mountain, La Pasteria, which is my product gluten-free, and it's a saved place for people eat gluten-free pasta. They have also my dessert, so a celiac can sit down with other people and eat secure on that place. Glue Not want to be not only a producer, but also to give experience to the other people or uh, share my knowledge to the other restaurant, to the other place, how it's important to have 
safe place for celiac or other allergy. It's important. So if I'm allergic to gluten-free and someone is not, and we sit in one place, we have to enjoy both of us. It's not to be difference between with, without. Safe place is important for us. Many people with a celiac can be very sick, can be uh, sick for many days. And when we are talking about kids, to see kids sick is very bad. So let's think about the celiac is not a trend, but it is a disease. This is also, uh, I'm uh, Italian and for us, the taste first. I'm not producing anything which does taste anything. So I want to make uh, each product as to taste at least as close as the normal product. Also with the bread which you buy, you bought it before, it's also there. It's something which is mixing the blending. There is many, uh, many research behind it. So everything is research. For me, it's not just, uh, okay, we have to make a bread. We just take some mix, blending together, and then cooking, selling. It has to be always improved. So my employee always say, it's possible we cannot have always the same product. We have to always to be better and better. This is as to be like this. We have to research. We have a typical Norwegian, they call school buller, which is brioche bread with the vanilla cream. I made it, all the people they were praying, Dino, can you make it? Can you make it? I make different tasting. After two and a half year, I did school buller because it has to be, it has to taste something. Keep it fresh, not dry, taste something. This is important to taste. Actually, my idea, it was to produce, to be a small producer, three in Norway. Small trees in Norway. We have just 6,200 people living in Norway, in Tresil. And uh, my idea was, okay, the pizza, what I will know. When I present to a distributor, a supplier, a pizza, the special was, wait, he called everyone from the office and then said, this is this product we're going to deliver in all of Norway. We started in 2016 with 16,000 pizza bottom delivered in all over uh, base, let's say pizza base in all over Norway. We are over 170,000 per year. We are, uh, this is the first part, but we are over 40 different kind of product we produce here in a small tree seal in Norway. Cookies, we have bread, cakes. cakes, we have different kind of product, and we are also open when people are asking special requests, we are also making special request cake. Can be, the last week I had a request of pizza and, uh, of uh, cake, gluten-free, milk-free, egg-free. So this is our goal. Everyone can eat something good. In Norway, in Trisil, we have our small boutique where you can enjoy your, uh, your fresh pizza and buy our product. We have also on net, you can buy our product. And we have many, uh, many boutiques in uh, Oslo area or in Norway, which you can buy product. We have over 60 places they are buying from us and, and you can buy our product. Here we make a little bit, uh, we didn't make so big place, just 10, 10 seats. Which in high season, we are, we are serving this small place between 10 and 5, over 50, 60 pizza. So it's a place where you sit, eat your pizza, you go again up to the slopes, you can go walking on the centrum, so you can enjoy, uh, after you enjoy your pizza, you can do some other things. Little trees in Norway. We have also many products imported from Italy, which is the first things are already checked by me, which they are gluten free. So when you are celiac, you don't have to check all the, all the labels all the time. You just, you can close your eye and then you can take everything. Actually, in this area, when the kids are coming, I'm asking, are you celiac? Yes. Then I just close his eyes and then say, eat whatever you want. You are safe. So it's important for the parents to be in this environment for them, for the kids. So we have from the coffee, we have from the tomato, we have from olive oil, we have uh, pasta, we have uh, balsamico, we have so many products from Italy, which is there. You come here, you can buy and taste something. It's really Italian. Our olive oil are double check. They are olives. It's not Italian olive oil, but olive oil from Italian olives. 
So is, there is a big difference. Like, you know, in Italy we have more than, for example, in Italy we have more than uh, 600 different kind of olives. So when you blend together, it can be different flavor. So actually it's food experience, gluten-free. So not only food experience, but food experience, gluten-free. This is the plus. We do also takeaway during the, during the days, and we have a lot of people like our pizza. This is one of the best pizza in Trisil in Norway. We're gonna do three different kinds of pizza today. One pizza for, uh, one pizza will be tomato sauce, ventricina, well-known pepperoni in Norway, and onion with mozzarella. This is the first pizza we're gonna do. Second pizza we're gonna do with, uh, this is uh, my fantastic friend's kine, love it, is with, will be with sausage, Italian sausage, truffle, and duya. So we bring a little bit more Italian. And then I want to do something for our American friends with pineapple, but will be dessert pizza. So it'll be pineapple, onion, uh, pastry cream, cream, and then uh, with a touch of Italian, with the olive oil, mandarin, clementine olive oil. Here, this is uh, our place, this is our boutique or uh, place where you can enjoy your food. And today I will prepare the pizza, I will cook in our uh, small oven, 100% Italian. His uh, that oven is made in Sardinia, stone oven. So today we're gonna do here, the, uh, today we're gonna do here the, the pizza. We're gonna use Italian product, of course, and we're gonna show you how we make the dough from the scratch. Good? Yeah. Okay. I hope. And then I think we should, this guy's gentleman came by yesterday, so you can reset, and then we're going to do the preparation, the dough and stuff. And we can buy